When a client is considering a big investment in printing technology, I like to step back from features and price tags and talk about total cost of ownership. It's been a disservice to our industry that there hasn't been more education on this topic. A buyer may be comparing two printers and one machine costs $100,000 less. So they gravitate toward the one that seems significantly cheaper. But buyers should investigate beyond price tag and know what it actually costs to own each machine. And we ask them, do you know how much it will cost to run 50,000 square feet each month for five years on that printer? The answer can be surprising. To calculate that total cost of ownership, we've got to fully understand ink cost, labor cost, machine cost, and build quality. Ink cost can go up or down depending on the amount of purging required or unnecessary color channels that may be used. Labor cost is affected by print speed and the ability to print unattended. If your customer needs 300 boards, how long will that take per machine? Will it require someone there babysitting it or can someone start the print and walk away? And next you have machine cost. One printer may appear to cost more per hour to run based on the initial price tag. But if that printer produces more in the same amount of time and it requires less labor to operate, that probably equates to a lower machine cost. Finally, build quality. As some machines age, their image quality degrades, which affects that print speed and that ink cost, which then affects the labor cost, which then affects machine cost. The cycle just keeps going. Now we've produced a white paper and a job comparison calculator as tools to help our clients fully understand these individual points and why they are critical to a buying decision. In the global, we really want our customers to be educated and to make the most informed purchase possible.